students welcome back to organic chemistry tutorials in this class we are going to talk about aromatic electrophilic substitution reactions okay let's let's go into the class first we are going to see the general uh, reaction so this is an aromatic system and this is an electrophile and, uh, and this aromatic compound electrophile is going to be substituted so this reaction is called as aromatic electrophilic substitution next we are going to watch about how this reaction mechanism is going to occur let's start first the low whatever the pi electrons inside the benzene ring is going to act as a lewis base okay in organic chemistry most of the reactions are acid base reactions you see now the benzene is going to uh, whatever the low, uh, pi electrons in the benzene is going to involve so that means it is going to act as a lewis base we know that lewis base means it can donate an electron so on this electrophile it is going to act as a lewis acid that means it is going to accept an electron so why i called it in most of the organic chemist chemistry reactions or acid base reactions now see once it reacts then what will happen it forms like this now it this one now this electron is getting shared with this electrophile that means this carbon lost the electron that means this will get the positive charge now we are going to see the the resonance structures how this that benzene arrhenium ion is going to stabilize okay now so see this is the resonance structure you see i am writing in the proper sequence you see this is getting moved here and moved here you see listen carefully first i am showing the movement of electron followed by i am writing the change so this we have to follow it if you follow it then we no need to memorize it okay then it will be very simple you see this electron is lost so i this carbon will get a positive charge so i will remain you write it as such okay and again you can write one more resonance structure see what happens like this like this so this carbon is lost the electron so we we'll get the plus charge we know this benzene stability is depends upon the sex set electrons but it contains only four pi electrons so this is highly unstable so then what will happen so this hydrogen will lose its electron and it will stabilize that so this is the reaction mechanism now my next question is could you tell me how many steps have been involved in this reaction in my experience the generally the students used to say they used to come calculate the the number of arrows i used it so what they used to say 1 2 3 4 they used to say it contains a four steps so please listen carefully you see we are used these double headed arrows double headed arrows are resonance structures okay this could not be outer so this is first step and this is the 
the second step. Now, if you tell me, so how many steps have been involved? There are total two steps have been involved in this reaction. Now, in addition, we will see the reaction kinetics also. Could you tell me whether the first step is going faster or slower, or second step is faster or slower? Then what could be the the kinetics reaction kinetics? The first step is always slow, and the second step is faster. Why? You see, the benzene is having the stability is depends upon the six pi electrons. So it is not ready to share its electron. So why the first step is always slower, but the second step is always faster because why it have to regain its aromaticity. So the second it will lose its proton and it regain its aromaticity. So why the second step is always faster. Okay. So this is all about. aromatic electrophilic substitution reactions hope you enjoyed this video kindly subscribe and share it if you like this video i encourage you to write any comments or suggestions in the comment sections thank you